news, my lovely, wonderful people. How Sanwolu is staging fallout of taking away NURTW chairman MC Oluomo's post from him. Report has it that MC Oluomo, you know, is very unhappy. And um, right now, you know, some say that there was an issue that may be out. And if the public get to know about it, MC Oluomo, as we all know, being connected to Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, we cause a major scandal. So the most important thing is get rid of that thing that can cause you a serious blow. And that is what you are doing to MC Oluomo. You will not be, be, believe it too. I, I can tell you for free that, you know, the matter has to be so serious all from the very, very top. Yes. From the very, very top. Here we see MC Oluomo, you know, being invited. The governor was there. I'm talking about road transport worker as if it's more than that. Too. The governor was there. The importer commissioner was, commissioners were there. Much more were there just to plead with MC Oluomo and to make him resign. And people are wondering, is there something more to this that we should know? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And now he's trying to manage it. Yeah, he's trying to manage it. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Breaking news. How MC Oluomo is how Sanwolu is caging fallout of taking away NURTW chairman post from MC Oluomo. As it relates to the happenings within the Lagos State chapter of the Union of the National Union of Road Transport Workers. NURTW sources says Governor Babajide Sanwolu has thrown as a grab of a gentleman and try in every way to ensure that he does something to save the situation now. Insider disclosed that the governor has warned that there that there will be very dire consequences for anyone who tries to use violence to upset the new arrangement in the transport union body. Former treasurer Mustafa, otherwise known as Sango, has replaced a recent MC Oluomo, better known uh, uh, as replaced Akinsoye, better known as MC Oluomo, as the chairman of NURTW. This is coming on the heels that a particular scandal about MC Oluomo is being shaded that if let loose to the public will implicate not only San Wolu, but the president, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, and in an attempt to ensure that none of this happen. M Governor Babajide San Wolu is standing in a position to ensure that this come to an end. Akinsoye attempt is, Akinsoye's attempt to remove him is gradually turning into a serious issue because he does not want to leave. However, he is being coerced and forced to leave the position, and this is causing a real serious issue. Much more, many people are wondering what the issue is that has led to what it is currently today. Insider disclosed that MC Omluomo is a, is, a very, is very rare and is not happy with the deal. I will deal with this later, but I just want to ensure that all is settled before I can move forward. In the committee and in the meeting, stakeholders, MC Oluomo has said he wants, he, if he will be replaced, he wants to be given a much bigger position. This is what has dosed out the tension that, is cost, that this is causing in Lagos State. Much more, a lot of people are wondering what the next line of action will be. So my lovely, wonderful people, you can see for yourself that you know, MC Oluomo, uh, you know, is trying his hardest, best possible to ensure that, you know, um, he, he, you know, he gets something. If they are going to use him and dump him, at the end of the day, he must get something in return. He will not be used and dumped just because some people feel it is their bet right. They need to cover up their track. And so in, res in trying to do that, he will become the scapegoat. He said, no. If anything is going to be done, I want to ensure and I want to make sure that, you know, things are done decently and in order. So this is what is happening. This is what is going on. And every single person is wondering what the next line of action will be. 
Well, my people, you can see that uh, the matter is becoming a really serious one and every single individual is wondering, what is it that MC Oluwomo did or that he has against Tinubu and uh, Sanwolu that they have to get him out of the out of the picture, out of the way in order for them to be able to in order for them to be able to, you know, uh, silence him or get him out, they need to do what they need to do. So the matter is really serious and everybody's wondering, you know, what the next line of action is. And whether you like it or not, the issue has become a serious one. No one wants to stay there and just be quiet at the, you know, at the instance of all that is happening. We all need to rise up. We all need to make sure that we do not allow this thing ever again. So Nigerians wake up. It is what it is. It is what it is. If we want this nation to change and we want things to be better, every single individual, we have to do everything, humanly speaking, possible to ensure that we do not leave things in the hands of those who want to destroy it. Whatever they have against MC Oluomo or MC Oluomo have against them, we will get to know. In the fullness of time, we will get to know. So Nigerians, this is what is happening. These are part of the things that are going on. Wake up. It is the dawn of a new day. If you want Nigeria to change, some people, can you imagine MC Oluomo after Iyachukundi and all that happened? He has to be sent out. He has to be sent away. He has to be shown the door saying, you know what, this is the door. But really, sincerely, truly speaking, what is it that MC Oluomo has done that they are trying to cover up very seriously? What is it that they are trying to cover up very seriously? So we want to get to the bottom of it. We want to understand it. And we want you all to know that at the end of the day, Nigeria will not remain in the same way, in the same vein that it has been. And if things are going to change, every single individual will have to come up, you know, with what truth is. And we need to redefine what we what we accept as truth. So these are part of the things that are going on. And we just want you to know that indeed, Nigerians, we all need this change. You know, we all need this dawn of a new day and we all need this real true transformation in order to make you know the country make the people and make everyone see that you know indeed nigeria can become a better place anyway my lovely my wonderful people it is important that every one of us you know um stand for what is true what is right and we 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 speak out to ensure that indeed you know the, the difference is felt please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. Remember, you have a voice. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. And from us, is bye for now. Bye-bye.